So ladies and gentlemen, every article right now that I'm reading about the whole Kim and Pete situation is that Pete Davidson is immature. So you know, I basically have covered everything but this. So let's talk about it. So this article reads, Kim Kardashian reportedly ended her nine month relationship with Pete Davidson over his immaturity. And then, you know, it also goes on to say, Kim Kardashian was totally exhausted by the romance, blah, 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 and everything else going on in her life. Basically everything I've already covered. Now, if you haven't seen those videos and you're new, that's why you gotta be subscribed to the boy, all right? So you stay up to date. But yeah, you know, all these articles reading Pete Davidson's immature, the reason why Kim broke up with Pete was his immaturity, blah, blah, blah. Which, you know, I understand. Pete Davidson's a lot younger than Kim. Also, his type of humor, I mean, I guess you could say is immature, right? But I truthfully don't think they broke up because Pete is immature. But I think they broke up because Kim has a bunch of kids that obviously aren't Pete Davidson's kids. Pete wanted Kim to travel the world and do all this crazy stuff with them that Kim obviously can't do because she has kids. So that's what kind of makes me think why they broke up, right? Pete wants to live like a bachelor, live this extravagant life. Kim's like, okay, I've been there, done that, but I got kids, I gotta take care of my kids. That's kind of why I don't think it worked out. But to like call him immature left and right just seems ridiculous to me. I don't think so. I get that he's a little comedian, throws a little joke here and there. Anyways, there, now I think I've covered everything so far. So if you want to stay up to date, I'm your boy, Viz.